Red to begin. According to the to the ranking and to the notes, quite heavily favored for being Dolan Solano here. But uh, we will see if if Vasquez and Montiel can put up a fight. I believe so. Yes, it will be a fun match to follow here. And if you're with us, please uh, make sure you tune in to uh, Studio Paddle's YouTube channel. Give us thumbs up. Subscribe. And also join us on the chat. Ask questions or give us some inside information on the players. Love to hear from you. I know uh, Vindal and Solano and Vasquez trains a lot together. So they three know how all of them plays. The question is if they can use like utilize it well. Yes, they're uh, sure very uh, f familiar with each other's games and uh, it's always that kind of thing when you know players very well it's um, it all depends on what kind of day you're having right yeah. <laughs> but I need to make a prediction so far I think we've been right right three out of three yeah so this time we're gonna say the winner is Vindal and Solano I think Six, three, six, two. Okay. Or six, two, six, three. First set, one break. Second set, two breaks. Hey, you've been pretty good at the predict predictions, so uh, yeah, we'll, see. <laughs> we'll see. And once again, Vasquez is serving. He does for every game here. Yes. Something that's not very common, at least I don't see that much at all in a Swedish paddle. Um, but definitely useful, I'm sure. Yeah, I've never seen someone warm up the serve before. I've had, uh, I've played, the, some women have. Um, Osa Eriksson and uh, Billy Gajic, uh, they uh, usually hit a couple serves before match starts. But other than that, I haven't seen it. It's not common at all. It's not a routine, which it's strange that it's not a routine. Now the players are entering the court, getting ready. Vindal and Solano looking very pumped. Usually the first game is held quite comfortably. So I do think we're going to see uh, an easy game here from Vasquez and Montiel. Caruso. And we have Vasquez starting to serve. Vindal was not at all uncomfortable flying into the middle from the forehand side there. Way too short lob. Way too high lob as well. Yeah, I take my prediction back. I think we're going to see a break. Explain for the listeners why you don't want too high of a... The lob. When you lob very high, the ball gets very high speed when it comes down, and you get a lot more spin in the smash. And especially Vindal is really quick and has really good smash. So if you're gonna lob uh, a good kick smasher, be careful with the with super the high, high lobs. Yeah. Okay. Especially if you lob uh, fast or short. Usually don't, they don't have time to put the feet in place and line up the body like that. Well, high intensity. Yeah, high here. intensity from the start here. Good point. It's 
fun to watch intense points from the very start. It's very usual to have uh, short points, but that it is the uh, last day of the tournament, so the players are a little more accustomed to uh, the courts, to the center, have found their game. Wow. Really simple mistake there. And in a match like this, you can't. Can't afford those. No. Looks like we have a quick break here, 15-40. And Solana's really, really good returns. Especially when Simon uh, serves to the glass, he plays often plays a high return to the back end of Montiel Caruso. We'll see if... Oh, no. Maybe on the second serve here. He might even go for a lob now. Yeah, high on the back end. Perfect, Kiza. Wow. Great start for uh, Vindal and Solano. Yeah, Caruso already looking a little frustrated here. Immediately goes to the court without his partner. Usually in paddle, that's a bad sign when uh, you split up with your partner. Meanwhile, Vindal is running into the court. Let's see her if she can hold her serve. and winning with grace there from Vasquez. Beautiful. Great overhead from Slano. Hard to the body of Vasquez. with quite a lot of spin as well, because yeah. then you have to really block it firmly. <laughs> He's looking for the lob on the left shoulder of Solano, but Vindal is too quick. One second. Bajad was a little too weak there from Vindal. Usually he likes to play it to the right or left side of Vasquez to the fence. But he played in the middle instead. I think we will see that Bajad quite a lot this match. from Solano as well. Now three times in a row, Solano always plays his overhead to the back end of Vasquez. What's so uh, interesting with these players is they can, they can play in such a small zone, they always get the ball where they want. And he said, oh, I want to play to the back end of Vasquez, and he always does. 
That's precision. Yeah. Let's see what they have in mind here, this game. Really can't afford to get lose this one. Wow. Wow. What a save. He just fishes that one up. Being doll. Great smash from Vasquez. love. Strong service game from uh, Caruso. Now they're on the scoreboard, 2-1 to Vindal and Solano. Try.
Great touch. Fifteen thirty. Once again, really important point here, thirty all. setting up the point perfectly for his partner Vindal. 40-30. Well. Yeah, Vindal and Solano had a little dip in that game, but uh, finished out strong. Now leading 3-1. Vasquez mm -hmm. to serve. So, Pontus, uh, you have just recently moved to Gothenburg. Is it because you believe that Gothenburg is the paddle mecca of Sweden? Uh, <laughs> oh, I, I know Helsingborg is the mecca, but uh, Gothenburg is closer to where I'm from. Yes, yes. Uh, and there are a lot of good players uh, in Gothenburg. In Gothenburg. Yeah. And there's a lot happening, a lot of centers, and uh, a lot of big tournaments. Here, for example, it's such a luxury to have uh, players like uh, Vindal Solano here. Uh, they've been out to play in Premier Paddle against uh, top players like LeBron and Gillan. So uh, it's a pleasure for us to have them here. Yeah, twice even in a row. Yeah, yeah. Something you can see here, there's zero counter attacks on the smashes. It's almost it's everyone impossible. Here, yeah, yeah. They, everyone here smashes way too good. Mm -hmm. And the courts are so fast yeah. as well. Solano and uh, Roland. Solano and Vindal train both in health. Wow, wow, wow. Los juegos, los juegos sin motor. El motor antes te va a pulsar la red. No te cabe. Tomar. Sorry about that. We had a little problem with the sound system. Pontus, continue. Uh, Roland, uh, both uh, Vindal, Solano and uh, Vasquez, they're training Helsingborg. It's a bit more south than Gothenburg. And a lot of other young talents train there as well.
Sorry for that short glitch. And we're back. Three two, uh, uh, three two to Windal, Bindal, as we say in Swedish, and Solano. Solano to serve. Solano to serve. Up one break. counter but not quite enough well uh, uh, Helsingborg it's uh, a lot of players moved there because of the paddle so it's basically like a mini Spain but you're right it's local And Matthew Richard, uh, you ask if it's possible to add the scoreboards on center court two. I will check if I can with the um, producer here. We're sitting uh, quite a bit away from that area. Matthew, the live score should be on its way, up and running soon, on center court two. Yeah. Incredible, Matthew. I have three break points. Let's see if they can hold their serve here. Montiel is looking, Caruso is looking very good right now. Well read of Caruso going in for the middle. Great volley from Solano. Twice an arrow straight to the feet of Caruso. We have 
15 all. And we have a, uh, an easy mistake from Solano. Yeah. Yeah, Vasquez and Caruso is looking like a completely different team today compared to yesterday. Huge difference. Especially Caruso, I remember him saying in the post-game interview that it was the worst <laughs> set <laughs> in the half. <laughs> Oh, they almost got in the way of that smash. Let's see. There. <laughs> and a little hug on that. Yeah, there's a um, whole different aura around um, Vasquez and Caruso today. Looks like they're up for the challenge here against Viendal and Solano. Yeah, if, if Caruso continues playing like this, it's going to be tough. Mm -hmm. Not that Vasquez is playing bad, he's playing really good, but Caruso is really... On it. Yeah. I wonder if Vindal and Solano is speaking Spanish. I think they are. I think they are. They were yesterday. Okay. Yeah, I, the coach, I think he works with uh, Solano in Denmark. I think Solano moved to Denmark. Okay. And he's working there in a the club. Right, right. And I believe that's their coach today. Perfect to be in Denmark, closer to Helsingborg to train uh, with uh, Vindal. Wow. <laughs> Just and like that. Out of there. Well played. Vindolens Lano. So it's playing two levels better again. Oh. He turned so quick in battle. So, so quick. The momentum. And the good teams they have, like I say, they have several gears. So they, they just uh, turn it up a notch uh, when they need to. Great angle from Vasquez. Yeah, Roland. Uh, usually in paddle, since the, the, the ball is not dead before it touches the ground on your side, technically, yes, they lose it, but uh, I'm not sure if, if uh, they would have taken it. I remember the first time I learned that rule, I was actually playing a match with Billy Guy. She uh, was playing on the backhand side, had a great smash. I was the, the, the consistent forehand player building the points for her, and she hits a great smash uh, that the opponents don't reach, and I catch the ball <laughs> standing on the other side. It was a little embarrassing, but that was in the first, first years uh, of my paddle career, not really knowing that's the way I learned about that rule. See if uh, Stefan Lovgren is asking us to increase the speaker sound. 
Is it for both of us, for both me and Pontus? Or is it, uh, do you prefer we lower the corpse? Now the corpse sound should be a little bit lower. We just did the court sound. Please let us know if it's better. Thanks for your feedback. Commanding serve game here from Vasquez. Great volley. And great. 5 4. Quite a close match here. Yeah, Solano and Vino started up very, very strong. But then Caruso and Vasquez started playing really well. And now it's a tough game, looking like a tiebreak match. Oh, perfect, Stefan. That's what I was talking about yesterday. When they get the new balls. Always hitting yeah. hitting them into the wall. <laughs> and I believe they do change of balls every first nine games and then seven. So now it's gonna be fast again faster. Yeah. Always an advantage to start out serving after the ball change. You can see perhaps Vasquez a little bit unused to the new balls. They are quite a bit faster since everyone here smashes. Yeah. I believe this match is it's going to be very tough to get a break. Wow. Great touch from Vasquez. 40-50. See if we see the lob from time on here. Wow. Frederick Schoen uh, reminds the viewers we're 67 viewers and only six thumbs up. Come on, people, give them a thumb up now. <laughs> Thank you for su the support, Frederick. Yes, please do give us a thumbs up. Subscribe to um, Studio Paddle on YouTube. 
show us some love and support so we can continue the English commentary section of this production. It's a new section for this year. Now we're at 10, 11, thumbs up. Keep it coming. And thank you, Frederick, again for the support. <laughs> Tell us where you're watching from, Frederick. Two last points here. Won them both single handedly. Or at least uh, finishing them both. And now you have to be feeling a little bit stressed here. 0 30, 5 5. Very common to get to break here. 4 4 and 5 5. And there's a little bit of a nervous first serve. And now. Let's see if we get the lob and uh, both go to the net. Very common. Oh, what a serve, yeah. Very weak second serve. Really look at insecure in his serves here. Frederick is way up in the north, Lulio. Lula. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for following us all the way up north in Lulio. you have the right to comment on. I think it's the, the seven fifth in Sweden. Yes. And uh, they organize some other tournaments as well. But nothing else I believe. Oh yeah, it's just uh, these um these FIP rise tournaments in um, Gothenburg. Oh wow. No break. Six five. See him cleaning the courts here. Do you know when the next FIP rise is here? Uh, 
Let me check. I think it is at, um, at the end of May. Six five. Actually, I have here in my calendar the weekend, seventeenth uh, to nineteenth of May, for the following fifth number four, fifth rise number four. Vindal is really famous for the Bajada straight to the fans of Vasquez, but so far he has never done it this match. Okay. Perhaps because Vasquez knows him too well. And we have four set points here. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel, Studio Paddle, on YouTube. Give us some thumbs up and uh, write to us in the chat. Let us know where you're watching us from. If you know any of the players, if you have any inside information about the players, we'd love to hear from you. Quite a lot of people here now spectating the game. Yes, the crowd is getting bigger and bigger. Hopefully we'll have a good show up for the finals as well. And I believe the final starts at three. Three at the earliest. Yeah. Yes. Thank you, Olivia Smith. Smith. Olivia Smith lo is loving the English commentary. Much love back to you. Thank you for following us. Hope wow. you enjoy the matches. Nej, men vi visste ju att det skulle vara en jämn, jämn match ändå, men eh, man måste ju hålla Daniel som favorit. Och, och speciellt nu när Simon har varit lite negativ till banan, det måste man också ta in, ta in i värderingen och sådär. Så att, nej, men jag känner mig säker. Swedish commentary uh, coming into our audio. It's a little discussion about uh, Vasquez has been um, having some, uh, giving some feedback about the center court here that it's uh, too very difficult to play on. very fast and uh, the ball skid quite a lot. 
uh, from the carpet. Thank you, Roland. The English commentary is also much better than the Premier League channel. Thank you for that. Glad you're enjoying the stream and uh, following us and giving us support. We appreciate it. That's the problem with the new balls. If you ever lob short, the, the point's over. Mm -hmm. And I believe 13. Next game we change balls as well. Here's 9, 7, and 16. Three more game. Third lob. Wow. Four is zero. Wow, well, that's what I was talking about. The infamous Vindal Bajada. Beautiful. And there was a big opening there. Maybe he um, was waiting for the right chance. Yeah. Because like you said, uh, Seaman is very familiar with his game, so Seaman is probably, Vasquez has probably been covering for that. Wow. Boost. Not much margin on that. Oh. Again, just a centimeter from the glass. Great precision in the lobs from Vindal. Great point. Third love. Oh, and just like that. So, so, so common in puddle. You have a great point, you win it. And then a simple mistake, and they're worth the same. They got the break as well. Extremely good bajadas. Vindal just, Vindal. yeah, and Vindal is laughing. He was amazed at how good that bajada was. Gave me the thumbs up to Caruso. Oh. 
Wow. So, so quick in the feed. But we have a break point. Goal on point. Amazing, amazing defense from Caruso. So fast. But it wasn't enough there. And now let's see who takes it. Let's see if he fails the first server here as well. Because he's done he did that twice. Oh good serve this time. Sorry. Yeah. No, no, one to two. Yeah, Vasquez is uh, and Caruso. Completely different team. Very good energy and intensity. I think, uh, like we mentioned in the beginning, that um, these teams, they probably know each other quite well. And it's going to be. Um, uh, very important for them to um, keep the focus up. The mental side of the game will be very important. Really utilizing their time here. Taking all of the nine seconds. to serve. Wow. Oh. Vasquez is not too happy about that one. What a bounce. Or lack of bounce on that volley. Really commanding start here. Think if they can get it. Get a quick game here. They're gonna break the next. Wow. I really like the overhead from Vindal. Yes. Only pushes the ball to the feet of Caruso. Not giving any pace to work with there. Yeah. And I also uh, like Solano's step forward, ready to go in for the kill there. Yeah, Solano knows the only thing possible for Caruso to do is play up. And if he stands close, he's going to remove the angle. Oh. <laughs> Two. Now we have a comment from uh, Frederick Schoen about the uh, English commentary. Uh, thank you for the kind words. 
from uh, from you about uh, my my I played just many years and uh, have quite a long experience with paddle. So it's a pleasure to sit here and share it with you and watch these great matches together. Even better when I have Pontus here beside me. He has a very good eye for reading the tactics of uh, each of the teams. Wow. <laughs> We're getting growl from Vindal. Are you a growler? Or are you very quiet? Never. Never. <laughs> I, w I never scream when I play. You're calm. You're you're from the north of Sweden, right? So th that's the uh, very calm. I I usually am very calm and collected, but um, I think I, I played some. Uh, oh, nice. A period of time with uh, Soleimani, and she's a very passionate player. I think she brought a lot of uh, passion out in me, especially when we had our had our um, tough tournaments together. Uh, that smash from Vasquez is not as easy as it seems. No. Because mm -hmm. it's so low. Mm -hmm. he, he goes for the pole quattro, but if it's just a little bit lower, it goes in the fence and they can take it. See, that's a much more comfortable angle, because he knows he can match the glass. But when you stand so close to the net, it's very risky to go for the four meters. If you hit the fence at the top, Mm -hmm. It's anyone's point. It could cause uh, good opportunities for the opposing team. The double handed backhand, the Swedish special. <laughs> Once again, four times in a row. <laughs> they really can't allow him to keep playing the Bajada. Indal and Solano. Once again, the quickest couple on the court. Usually, it's a sign of confidence. like a book there, but plays it just a little bit, just a little bit off. It's a good idea, going for that open space. Wow, what a shot. Break here, 1530. Oh, 
Oh. So much power in only the wrist. Oh no. Ooh. 15 40. Three unforced errors from Solano and Vindal here in this game. See if they can dig their way out of this. And there's the break. now perhaps uh, getting a little shaky yeah confidence building up on the side of Vasquez and Caruso wow yeah and it's out We're heading towards a 5-2 here. We have another mistake. Again, they keep giving him the bajada. So far, five out of five winners. Right. That's out. Five two. Just out. <laughs> A little dip in uh, Vindal's and Solano's the focus there, it felt like. Yeah. And it cost them. Big well, six mistakes in a row. All right, let's see if Bean and Solano can turn it around. Start off strong. Really, really strong start here. Dirty love. Oh. 
Now the mistakes have turned here. Would you have gone for that smash so far back in the court? I think uh, this F40 zero. Just try. Ah, that's quick. Yeah. I doubt we would have gone for that in a 30 30 or. Right. Just talking about setting up the lob high. New balls. New and balls. As you said, favors the server. Yeah, just like that. Five, three, Vasquez serving. And they're trying to make the balls a little softer. Because uh, when you immediately open them, they're incredibly hard. So much power in them. They keep giving him the bajada there. like it's going to be a third set here. Yeah. So close. Very loud. We have to wonder if it's gonna be like the last game where they get reignited in the third set and Bean Dolan Solano takes it. Or are Vasquez and Caruso gonna keep up the momentum here? It very much looks like a third set here. 40 0. Yeah. Oh. One to one. Six three to Vasquez and Caruso. Solid set from them. And a little bit of a dip in focus from uh, Vindal and Solano. Will be interesting to see the game here in the third set. Who could keep the focus? Also, the tricky thing with paddle is that you have to keep up your focus as consistently as possible, but also. Um, keep it up together with your partner. <laughs> Sometimes it's easy that one is uh, on and the other one is off. Yeah, it's gonna be an exciting third set here. I wonder if Lano and Vindal is gonna find their, since on, on paper at least, they have a higher level. Rank 54 and 74 yes. versus 119 and, I don't remember Caruso, but something like 130. They should be the clear favorites here. But like we mentioned before, there are um, when it's it's difficult when there are teams that uh, know each other very well. It's um, they know how each other plays, so it's a lot about uh, what kind of day you're having. Yep. So uh, we'll see how this third set uh, turns out. If we look at the statistics there. You can see for the set being 6-3, it's only six points. So 
But now it's gonna be interesting. All right, Solano to serve and start the, fir uh, the first game of the third set. And I just heard on the second semifinal that the Amaya brothers won. So they will be waiting in the finals. Yep. Now you have to think if Solano and Vindal start to doubt themselves here. the shift in tempo, but um, oh, it's too bad that he missed that being dull. Every point here is so, so, so important. Caruso, <laughs> Caruso very disappointed in himself. A little shame to <laughs> look at Vasquez. Vasquez, the older player, more experienced, yeah. telling him to, okay, let's think of the next point. Third all. Wow. wow. Great from Vasquez. <laughs> now we're looking at two break points here in the first game. And now, all they have to do is hold their serve. And we have Vasquez? Well, if they continue like they are now, yes, I do think that. But um, 
anything can happen. But at the way they're playing right now, especially Caruso. I don't see how they're going to break them if they play like this. Vindal admits that he touches the net. Sportsman like, very. Wow. Volley. What a volley. Incredible. Just like that, 40 0. Wow, the Vindal special. Vasquez and Caruso are on fire right now. Confidence is growing bigger and bigger. See how Solano and Vindal respond to this. For me, if uh, Vasquez and Caruso doesn't lose their focus, it's, it's over. If they keep having this focus, all of their serves. And intensity, yeah. yeah it's 6-4. There's nothing they can do. But it's very easy to lose your focus. Just two points is enough. Zero thirty. That's all they need. Wow. Such a good block. Yes, and really good movement from Vasquez to read that shot. He was in the right place. Just missed the ball in the net. I'm surprised we have, haven't seen any drop shots yet. I think Wienwald tried one in the first set and failed. We never saw any no. other attempts. Great volley. Love. Oh. Great hands from Caruso. What reflexes. Thirty fifteen. Thirty all. It's looking a little shaky now. Mm. Just like that, two break points. I really don't think they can break back two two games. Vindal and Solano has to win these two points. Oh, wow. A lucky bounce for Vindal. And it's a 3-0 lead for Vasquez and Caruso. You have to believe they're going to get the 4-0 lead here with their serve. The hole is getting deeper and deeper. <laughs> so um, very important for uh, Vindal and Solano to uh, get their focus together, believe in it. <laughs> Dare to play their game. See, we have uh, 90 viewers, 91 viewers right now. Please give us a thumbs up. Subscribe to the Studio Paddle channel. Show us some love.
Caruso to serve. Three love. If they get a commanding start here, I think they take this. He reached up perfectly, yeah. Last to see that on oh fire, man. on fire. He read that first Pajada perfectly. Immediately follows up to the middle and play. Plays right on his feet. Wow, 4-0. Mm -hmm. Nice try. Drop shot attempt. 30 all. 40 15. 40 15, right? Because it was 40 low. Yeah. Error from the referee. 40-15. Six out of six winners to the Bajara. We have 0-4. All right, this is uh, quite a steep uphill for uh, Solano and Vindal. Love, four. Perfect in the corner. Great shot. It might be too late to wake up now. Yeah. Still, uh, of course, you want to find your flow, but. Um, very, Such very, a late start. Yeah. Great block from Vasquez. Another great block. Caruso. Uh, the men in black, they're on fire. Vasquez and Caruso. Wow, he reads it perfectly. Yeah. Great save from Vindal. Wow, what a drop. Nice. They're playing incredible right now. <laughs> Vasquez and Caruso takes this point. They've got to feel nervous. Head 40 0, you have a few seconds to go. Too short. I think it's gone. <laughs> 4 1. Samuel Vauden, amazing uh, comments in the chat. Amazing to have English commentary. Thank you. And you're welcome and thank you very much for following Tjena, us. Tjena, Kalle på Vida här. Uh, idag tänkte jag presentera en av våra nya produkter. Make sure that you uh, give us a thumbs up and uh, subscribe to the uh, YouTube channel, the Studio Paddle on YouTube. And keep writing up. Keep writing in us in the chat. Let us know where you're writing from. Let us know if you're enjoying it. This is the first year for English commentary and we would love to continue throughout the year. We are planning to have uh, f 
four more tournaments this year here in uh, Gothenburg at Bon Paddle Arena. Let's see now if they can hold their serve. Four to one. It's a big uphill climb for Vindal Solano. Let's see how uh, they handle it. Great lob. Great pakala. Wow. Oh. Almost, almost. bad way 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 on the tape on the net feels like in the second set at 3-3 when they started getting the mistakes mm -hmm. and, and they never stopped yeah meanwhile Vasquez and Caruso started playing even better and every game they're playing better now they grew stronger and faster yeah wow, wow. <laughs> 4 1 40 love. The opportunity there. That was not uh, very weak, Pahala. Not expected there. Great take from Caruso. Very oh, fast point. speed from Vasquez. Point. Can we get a smile from Vindal? Thirty love. Net roller there. Only love. And we have five two. Okay. It's gonna be tough. Two breaks. Is there a slight shift in momentum, or we just have a, a couple lucky breaks here? I ju I don't think Kivasko and Karu to care no. about that game. I think they they know they win this game, and they just gave it. Mm. Save their energy for their serve. There's no need to stress and go for the break there. I think they close the match here six two. Perhaps if uh, Vindal keeps getting the net rollers, they get the game. But otherwise, Caruso and Vasquez is looking. They're looking way too strong. Yeah, they are. Perhaps if they only had one break, I would believe it. But two, too much. It's tough. Let's 
serving for the match here is Caruso. Every point here, so, so important. Caruso looking a little frustrated from Vasquez's drop shot there. Was a little too high. And we have zero 15. save. Oh, beautiful. Perhaps we counted them out too early here. They were 30. This point here. It's going to be a deciding factor. Wow. They keep giving him the Mahada. And he keeps winning the points. Seven out of seven. Well, he's also very fast in, in breaking into Simon's uh, Vasquez side there. Uh, I think if they're going to lob him, lob either corner. Mm. Because if they lob his corner, he gets the backhand. Oh. Wow. Oh. And we have break points. Three. <laughs> what a turn. Simon telling Caruso to take it easy. Relax. Oh. Just like that. <laughs> Smell a little comeback here. Yeah, uh, being dull and slow or smelling blood. See a little bit more focus here from being dull and Solano. I think they're gonna hold their serve easily. Wow. They're starting to look shaky again, Caruso and Vasquez. The momentum turned so quickly. And you see this all the time in paddle. That's what's so <laughs> that's charming about paddle, that it can swing back and forth so quickly. Lob. Very poor Shakira there from Solano. Fifteen thirty. This point now. Very scary having a second serve here. We're giving them a free lob. Oh. Oh wow. 
Eyes out. No. It's in. Still alive. Well played of Solano. Very well. Didn't Mentally. Yeah, didn't hesitate for a second there. Mentally, I mean, uh, second serve at 15-30. 3-5. Now it's 30 all. 30-30, always so important. Great lob. Always plays on Simon's backhand there when he gets overhead. See if he does again. No. Too high from Vasquez. Way, way too high. And you have to wonder now, is their confidence shattered? They got crushed in their last game when they served. Maybe not shattered, but I'm sure they're hesitating now. And I uh, have to commend Solana for a great game there. Kept his focus and uh, dared to play the right shots. Let's see now. Do you believe in the break or are they holding for the match? I'm thinking I would like to be it to be a break for a longer match and yep. a more exciting match, but I think it's gonna be tough to break. I Vasquez. think they break now. Yeah, I don't think you think they're gonna break. Yeah. Look at how pumped they are, they're jumping like the first set. Great first serve. Fifteen love. Great serve once again. And to the body of Solano, yeah. Very love. Wow. Go for it. No. <gasps> Go for it now. Vindal oh. touches it. Any they keep. They're still alive. 15.30. Let's watch. The Great save from Vindal. This point now. <laughs> Great block. And they have the net. Wow. No, no, no. <gasps> oh. Wow, 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 30 all. I think they're breaking this. I think they're too, too, too strong mentally. This point is everything right here. Good serve to the glass and a lob from Swallow. Oh, they give him a second serve. Mm. 
to the left shoulder of Simon. Go for it. Yeah. Wow. Beautiful. One point remaining and the match is open. I think they're taking this point here. Being all Look. Ah. Touch. Oh, touch? Touch from Vindal. Really? Yeah. Yeah. Oh. And he gives that one. Yeah. Golden point. That's called sportsmanlike ship. What a brutal way. Sportsmanship. To maybe end the game. <sighs> or not. Find the Shikita Vasquez. Perfect block. Perfect Solano. Great ball is here. Ooh. Ooh. High lob. Going through. Oh. What a match. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I don't what think anyone match. believe this. Vasquez and Caruso on to the final after a 7-5-3-6-6-4 uh, win. And they will be up against the... Amaya brothers. Yes, Amaya brothers. Melendez Amaya. Yeah. That will be an exciting match with a lot of speed and uh, explosivity. Stay tuned.